Hi, today we're going to show you a quick example of bringing in 2D details and getting into 3D space. In ZW3D, after you import your drawing into the 3D space, you have a bunch of move commands. So if I want to start organizing this 2D set of lines and curves into 3D space, I can use a move point to point command. So I'm going to window pick this. I'm going to let the software snap to the midpoint of that line. I'm going to snap over here to this center. And in the same command, I can say what was pointing in the X positive direction, I now want to point in the Z positive direction. So it stands that up for me. That looks right. I will accept that. And we'll do that one more time with the bottom view as well. So again, these entities, we're going to move it after we snap to the midpoint, we're going to snap to zero. And this time we're going to tell it what was pointing in the Y positive direction. I now want pointing in the Z positive direction. So we were able to take this 2D lines and arcs and get it into 3D space. Well, now what can you do with it? Well, let's say we want to sweep this curve down this curve trying to make the surface of our mouse and let's thicken that by about one millimeter. I see my dynamic preview. I can accept. So now I'm starting to make the shape of the curve of the mouse. We can further use this geometry. I'm going to make a curve list of this inside. We're going to go from here to here and we're going to remove that material. Maybe that's the hole for the mouse to come through. Actually, I'm sorry. Let me do this again. Shift pick. And we're going to do a bigger slot because this one had a kind of a plastic insert in the mouse. So now that we've done a couple simple surfaces, we can bring in our component of the circuit board assembly. And again, we're going to do some simple alignments. I'm going to tell it the middle of this should be lined up with this plane. And this diameter should be lined up with the same concentric of this. So now we brought in our circuit board, quickly went from 2D views to a 3D surface trying to get an idea of whether or not this particular assembly will work with this um, 2D details. So that's it. That's a quick example of 2D to 3D in ZWCAD. Thanks.